I failed no one. My rejects are exactly what Jador asked for. She simply lacks the ability to command. They are strong, healthy, and useless to me. I need perfection. If a few thousand are rejected, so be it. My work will purify the Krogan. We will not be restored. We will be renewed. Uh -huh. Alright. <clears throat> if your pet soldier is as strong as you think, maybe I can use him. Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage, but my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. Kill my legacy with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. Now you know something. Don't jerk me around, Okir. I will give you everything I can. My legacy must not suffer this insult. Jador will be with the rejected tanks. Kill her. I will stay and do what must be done. Kill the door, Shepard. I do what I must to save my legacy. Mm-hmm. This is gonna take a couple of tries, I'm sure, a lot of Krogan. Alright, let's save it here, and there we go. Hey, what the fuck? I think she's talking about Damn it, it's, even the stagger takes so fucking long. I mean, the aggressive tactic does work. I mean, I just plow away at Jador as fast as I can. Get rid of her, because I think she might be the one releasing the Krogan, I'm not sure. Maybe the Krogan stops releasing after the Mac is destroyed. I think she's talked enough. What? I'm behind bloody ass cover. Stop yanking me around. Jesus fucking shit. Run here for a second. Why are you interested in me? Look there, there's a nice little. Son of a bitch, Shahid. Sorry, just fucking run! Just don't stand there and shake it off. Shake it off behind cover. Smart man. Are you still not dead? There you go, now you're dead. 
Eat your dead again. I got you. Get through my shield. <laughs> back there. Can't effectively hit him either. that. Tries not bad. Probably sacrifice a lot of heavy ammo, but you know. That's the guy who didn't brought his helmet. Repeated message. Okia wasted his life to save this single Krogan? A bullet in the brain would save us a lot of headaches. Do we need the trouble of a pure Krogan? The normal ones are hardly team players. We won't know until he's out, which is too late if there's a problem. Normandy? Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. And he's a big one. Looks like he has a fart he's holding up like, oh shit. No, 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 no. Be a problem, we'll uh, shove it to the side with a detector. Glad everybody's allowing me to make all the choices. You know? Thanks. Bringing the Krogan to study makes sense, but I have concerns about waking it. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. <laughs> I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Concerns? We don't know anything about it, Commander. I'm not saying we take a crowbar to it right now, but I'm not giving up a potential resource. It's your decision, Commander. Just be careful. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with them. Except it's not really the cargo hold, it's just a little room on the left. <laughs> So let's consider the cargo hold unless in that case it's a very fucking small one. Alright, so I'm sure we found some stuff down there which we can use. Sniper rifle damage. Yeah. Won't be using those. This guy here, but you know. Krogan vitality. 
I'll work. No. Alright, whatever. Alright, Morden. Thought you had anything Check. to say? How can I help? Have Do you got a minute to talk? Later, updating crew dental records. All Cerberus personnel have cyanide capsules and molars. Primitive. Ocular nerve flashbangs harder to disarm. Anything else? We'll be here if you need me. Okay. Is it true we have a pod containing a baby Krogan down in the cargo hold? Not a baby. He's a full-grown super soldier, ready for combat. Please be careful if you decide to... birth him. His personality is completely unknown. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if the elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Hmm? Kelly? Alright, let's speed us on our way to Joker. How fast I can run. Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? Quiet enough. I... What the... Trouble? No, it's nothing. I... Son of a... Very funny, Edie. Real original. Stop it. You did insist on manual control, Mr. Moreau. <laughs> what do you think about the people we're picking up? Well, about the ones you went out with last... I would never say anything against Miranda. And expect to survive the reprisal. Zaid is like you, but takes checks. As long as it's not my money, we're good. It's just my opinion, though. There's really no need wait. to go spreading around. Wait, 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 wait. I can't get paid for this job. That's it for now. God. See you, Commander. Damn, I should have known that. Just go sit in the dark for a while and think about your sins for telling me that. I don't want money. Sure, this dude has nothing to, interesting to say. Commander, I'm more interested in just talking for a little bit. Yep. Commander. All right. Of course, I'm not gonna talk with Mr. Listen. Just shut up! I know! Fuck him! You can wait! What's wrong? They lost contact with New Canton. Might be the collectors. Did your family get out of there? I don't know. There's no communications yet. I'm sure they're safe. Y you'll see. Alright, I was hoping there was more of that. Shepard, the men's restroom is on the port side of the ship. I know. Just wanted to try something. I was just thinking about you. Okay. Joker and Edie are like an old married couple. Oh, you weren't thinking about me? I keep expecting me. to walk in on them bickering about the temperature in the cockpit. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person. But when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. This one security guy keeps staring at me. I think his name is Bert. I'm used to being watched by security, but they're usually staring at my eyes or watching my hands. I might have to start cloaking through the CIC from now on. Come back later. I'm sure I'll I don't give Bird such a hard time. The Red Rose. That used to be my calling card when I first started out. In place of whatever I took, I left a single Red Rose. It wasn't until I met Keiji that I realized how silly it was. He had a way of making you realize when you were just being sentimental. Right. Commander, what can I do oh, for you? I haven't switched out of your armor yet, have you? You have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another time. I'll let you work. Fine. Of course, Commander. Jeez. All right, Ian. I haven't had a meal that good in a long time. I didn't think Rupert had it in him. All right. Shepard, talk to you later, Garrison. I'll be here if you need me. Psych, I don't want to hear about your calibrations. There's one person we can talk to. Let's see if these two funny bones have anything to say. 
No. <laughs>